Yo, Chicago, if you ain't up on the morning, right? On the line, I have Candy Burris, the beautiful friend of Tony Sko in the morning, Riot, joining us. Good morning, Mamacita. Good morning. How you doing today? Are you tired? You sound a little tired. I just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> now, did you put your butt to sleep, your own butt to sleep, with your new little toy you got going on, girlfriend? Oh, we're talking about that bedroom candy. <laughs> yes, you've got, uh, you decided to expand your empire with a new sex toy. It's called Bedroom Candy. I do like the logo, by the way, the backwards B and the K, the gold. For those um, out there that are kind of like, what the hell are they talking about, Bedroom Candy? Break it down, sister. Well, Bedroom Candy, I call it, is it's my intimate luxury line, basically. It's, um, you know, a, um, adult self-pleasure products. But it's a twist on your typical toys. It's not like, you know, the kind you necessarily see in your, you know, regular store or whatever. It's, it's more so, it's a lot of discreet products. Um, it's, it looks um, like so, lipstick, pink lipstick. Yes, <laughs> yes. One, one that we have that's like similar to what the vibrator would do, I guess. It's called Candy Kisses, and it looks exactly like a lipstick. Like, nobody would even know what it was unless you told them. Like so it could them. be with you at work in your little clutch at the club. You never, ever know. Never, ever know. And the only product that we have that's like, you know, that you would definitely know what it is, and it's called Happiness and Joy. And that's because it's, you know, a dual sensation, you know, vibe. And, um... It's similar to what a lot of people know is the rabbit, but it's a modern version. And it has a um, wireless remote that connects to the, your MP3 player. And it I sends, was just going to say, I'm it, like, it what the hell? Music. And yeah, not just it that, vibrates the music. It vibrates music. For those of you who don't know, you got to check this out. She's got a link. You, could, you catch her link for the website at WGCI.com, keyword morning riot. But on the website, you'll see the picture of these things. And then if you scroll down, it says USB charger, one-year manufacturer's warranty, powerful motor, mm-hmm. whisper quiet. Girl, what the hell made you decide I'm going to do this? Well, you know, it's funny because um, actually I came to Chicago last year. <laughs> And I had um, did an interview with Dr. Laura Berman on her radio show. Yeah, she's and when cool. I and, and when I went over there, she had her own toy with her, you know, with her, you know, logo, her name, or whatever. And I was like, man, okay, she got a talk show and she got her own toys. And you know, I do my um, my Wednesday night web show, Candy Coated Nights, and I've been doing it for the past year and a half. And it's about, you know, we talk about sex and relationships. So I'm like, I got a talk show. I got my own toys. And so that's when I started doing the research on it. And then after that, I started, you know, after I was researching, I was like, man, I don't know if you know, but fact is 70% 70 of women have never experienced an orgasm ever. And that's partially because, you know, people are so hush-hush and taboo. They're scared to explore their own bodies or whatever. And I was like, you know, it needs to be a product that, you know, you know, it's really pushed to women to where we feel, you know, comfortable having the product, you know, it's more discreet. You don't have to feel ashamed to buy it or whatever because it's not in no crazy looking packages or whatever. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, we still, you know, spice up the bedroom a little bit. Talking to Candy Burris, you also had this as part of the Real Housewives of Atlanta. You started talking about the Empire creating the sex toys as well, so you have an outlet to expand that Empire quickly, like you said, with your own show, with the show um, on television. And and you seem to be the one that wants to kind of uh, portray herself as more of, listen, I'm not into all of that drama. I'm doing my own, you know, creating this and creating that and being positive with, the, you know, all of that kind of thing. Is that what you want to portray as far as... For your own you know, reputation or for being a role model? You know what? It's like I went into this show. I wasn't trying to be a quote-unquote role model. I just said I was just going to do me and hopefully people like me, you know, and I'm just going to be myself. I don't, you know, do anything on purpose. It's not like I'm purposely trying to act a certain way. But for me, a majority of the time, like, I don't really have a reason to... Like, it's nothing that they're doing or saying really affects me like that because, like, it's not going to stop anything I got going on. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, like, normally they don't even really push my buttons. Every now and then they may, you know, say something that, you know, gets me a little heated. But overall, like, I'm just like, I don't really have a reason to be arguing with them. 
Well, congratulations to you, Candy Burris. Still doing your thing, and um, you've, the TV show is a hit. You know, you're still the songstress and songwriter. Now you're expanding the brand with Bedroom Candy, which you can check out again. The link is posted at WGCI.com. Keyword is Morning Riot. Make sure you look into that as well. And you've got good deals. I will say that. Well, thank you. I mean, you can go to bedroomcandy.com. Where you, and please, everybody, follow me on Twitter. It's just Candy, K-A-N-D-I.